Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to install the Railcraft mod for Minecraft 1.7.10. Now, what this mod does is essentially just what the title says. So, um, it just adds in rails and carts into your Minecraft game. So, um, yeah, it's a pretty cool mod. Um, so to install it, what you want to do is visit the description, which is uh, below the video, and uh, you just want to click both of the links under downloads. So you want to click on both. And now, once you've opened them, the first one is going to take you to the Railcraft mod page, and then the next one to Minecraft Forge. So uh, on the Forge page, where it says Select Minecraft Version, you want to click this arrow here, and uh, then you just want to select 1.7.10, so click that. And uh, then where it says 1.7.10 Latest, you just want to look for that, and then you want to go across until you see Installer, so click that. This is just going to take you to AdFly, you just want to wait 5 seconds just at the top here. And uh, then you just want to click Skip Add. And uh, then where your downloads are located, it's going to come up with this message, you just want to press Keep. Once you've done that, we've installed Forge, so you can close this. And now for the mod itself, you just want to go to this page and then scroll to the bottom until you see 4 1.7.10 and you want to click Download from Server 1, so click that. That's going to take you here, you just want to click download, and uh, once you click that, it's going to come up with this message again, you just want to press keep, and uh, now we have the required files, you just want to click show all downloads, and uh, then you just want to get these two files and drag them to your desktop. Okay, so just like this, so you should have Minecraft Forge and then Railcraft, so uh, once you've got those two files on your desktop, you can close this. And uh, now what we want to do is install Forge, which is essentially just a thing which uh, you need to make this mod work. So you just want to double click on it, or if it's not like a Java file, just right click, open with Java. So click that, and uh, then it's going to come up with the installer, you just want to press OK, just like this, and uh, then this is just going to install Forge. Okay, so once it's installed, it's going to say complete, and uh, you just want to press OK. And uh, now we've installed Forge, you can delete this file here, so right click delete. So now we have the thing what makes the mod work, now all we need to do is add the mod. So to do that, press the Windows key and R at the same time, and that's going to bring up this run thing. Basically in here you just want to put percentage, app data percentage, so just type that, and uh, then just press OK. And uh, this is just going to bring you to your roaming folder. And uh, what you want to look for is .minecraft, it should be at the very top, so go into that. And uh, then we should be here, and uh, this is just where all your Minecraft files are. So uh, in this empty space here, you just want to right click, new folder, and call it mods, M-O-D-S, just like that. Then you want to go into that mods folder, and uh, get this railcraft uh, file just here. You want to click on it, and drag it into your mods folder, so let go. Just like that, so now in your .minecraft you should have a mods folder, and uh, in that mods folder should be the Railcraft mod. So once you have that, you are good to go. Um, so you should have that, and then if you've installed Forge as well, which we have, uh, it should work. Okay, so now if you click this arrow to view your profiles, you will see that there is another one here, and uh, it should be called Forge, and uh, this is just the mod. So select it, and uh, then press play, and that will launch the mod. Um, but before you do that, you can press edit while it's selected, and uh, you can actually just rename it to like mod, something like that, then press save, and then again, to run the mod, just select that profile and press play. Okay, so now you'll know if it works, if it says four mods loaded, and uh, then if you just go into a world, just create a new one. you will see that um, if you press E and uh, then you should see another page if that achievement is going to move. Um, so yeah, you click this and uh, then here if you click on the Railcraft is all the Railcraft items. So as you can see there's quite a lot and I believe there's also yeah more in here. Um, so yeah, that's basically the mod. Um, so if it didn't work for any reason, you know, doesn't come up or comes up with an error, please leave a comment and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. And uh, yeah, if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you all later.